Hey guys! So today's video is going to be my boxy sherm unboxing. I spent like three hours doing my eyebrows right just now. I haven't done my eyebrows in like two weeks. So I like took forever only to realize those bubbles just really get me. <laughs> only to realize that the first product in the box uh, is probably going to remove my eyebrows. I think we'll see. I'm glad to be back back into the swing of things and I know it's already like October 17th when I'm posting this video so I'm a little late but without further ado let's just jump into it I feel like I haven't filmed in forever like I don't think I, like I forgot how to do it you know so this is the pamphlet situation the theme this month is alter ego okay so this is the first product we're gonna be trying out today this is from a brand called Dermovia Dermovia? Dermovia. This is a detoxifying charcoal peel paste and lace compression mask. The naturally blended peel paste in conjunction with the mask grips to the skin, helping to further draw impurities for a deep decongestion and exfoliation experience. I have this pimple here and it is driving me crazy. And it's not because it's like giant, because it's not like super huge. I mean, it's pretty big, but it's not like enormous it just has the ugliest like white head like i, I want to pop it but i know i shouldn't pop it and i'm not gonna pop it but it's just so ugly it's like calling my name i have a little mirror here and it's like <gasps> staring at me all right let's see oh cleanse and dry face done apply an even layer of peel paste to targeted areas avoid eyes da, 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 da. let me get my hair out of my face it comes with two like little lace things so like in the little photo she has this like on her t-zone oh Oh my gosh, this is like super sticky. I don't even know how much I'm supposed to apply. Okay. To be honest, um, I'm a little bit concerned about this lace situation. This lace is supposed to help you remove the face mask. This is the actual mask. And this lace is just to help you peel it off. I don't know, I just kind of have the feeling like this isn't gonna peel it off. I don't know, it doesn't feel like it's like sticking to the face mask, but of course I could just be prejudging. <laughs> so I'm gonna leave this on for 20 minutes and then I will come back and we will peel it off and we will see if it works. Okay, it's been 15 minutes. Oh, my light. <laughs> okay, it's been 15 minutes. Um, this mask does start to cool and you start to feel like your face really, really cold. And that's kind of cool. So I wanted to mention that. Oh my God, I'm like actually scared. Like I'm actually, I'm actually scared right now. Okay, gently peel off mask in downward motion. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Ah! Oh, that wasn't so bad. Wow, this lace does work. <laughs> oh my gosh, I feel like that was so much easier because of the lace. Wow. Oh my gosh, I'm scared of this part. Oh, okay. Oh! <laughs> Big Bertha is definitely still there. Okay, so looking at the thing, I do see Porter. I do see like my blackheads kind of like sitting on this thing and my nose looks really, 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 really smooth. Oh my gosh, and my cheeks. My skin does look cleaner. Like it does look like it detoxified a bit in these areas, but man, I don't know if these kinds of masks are worth it for me. They hurt, they hurt my face. I mean, I like the results a lot. I mean, once the redness goes down, we should be good. Okay, so really quickly, I'm gonna go rinse off my face and then start up on some of my makeup and then I'll be back to finish unboxing this box. Okay, so I just put on my Thrive Cosmetics CC cream and then some bronzer. And I will say that my face stayed pretty red after that mask and the redness is like definitely peeking through my CC cream. I mean, my CC cream isn't full coverage or anything, but just wanna let you know if you're planning on using that mask, do it like hours before you do your makeup. I have some concealer and powder on my eyes and that's what I'm gonna use today to prime the eyes because the next product in the box is this. So this is from the brand Pure. 
This is the Midnight Masquerade Face Palette. You have some eyeshadows and like face colors in here. And then when you open it, this is what it looks like on the inside. You have blushes, a highlight, and this can kind of be a bronzer, like a bronze topper. And then you've got your eyeshadows here and a little tiny mirror up here. So you guys know the drill. I'm just gonna do a quick little look, apply some of this to my eyes and my face, and then I'll give you my thoughts. Okay, so it turned out to be not a very simple look, <laughs> but I actually really, really like how this look turned out. I'm not gonna lie, like when I first opened this, I was like, it's, you know, it's nice. I like that you do get two things. I like that you get some eyeshadows and you also get some face products. And, oh my God, I didn't put any on my face. I'm gonna do that now. And you can use these as eyeshadows. Like I used this in my crease because this doesn't really have like a light crease color. And I used it in my crease and it was perfect. Oh, I forgot to highlight my brow bone. I'm gonna take the Twilight highlight. I'm gonna highlight my brow bone. When I first opened this palette, I looked inside and I was like, oh, I know it's okay. But like, when I used it, I ended up really, really liking it. I really like this blue eyeshadow. It is extremely pigmented. I didn't even use any Fix Plus or any water, so very, very impressed with this one. I would say I judged this book by its cover, and I shouldn't have done that. Good stuff, good stuff. Really quickly, I'm gonna show you the next product in the box because it is a mascara, and it's actually a really, really good mascara, and I hadn't repurchased it, so I haven't used it in months. This is the It Cosmetics Superhero Mascara. Oh my gosh, I haven't, wow, I've been out of the game for a while. I haven't told you guys the prices of anything. So the face mask I used first, that was a full-size product, and that was $30, so that was expensive. This eyeshadow palette is $38 for this guy, and then this is also a full-size product, and this, Retails for $24. So let's pop this guy on. Okay. That pink blush is extremely pigmented. Like, wow, this look got real crazy in two seconds. I mean, it didn't help that my cheeks were already red. That's freaking pink. I should've known. Ignore my cheeks. <laughs> I'm gonna go in with the highlight in the palette and highlight my cheeks. I absolutely love this highlight. Like, as soon as I put it on my brow bone, I was like, ah, beautiful. Because it's such a pretty, like, golden champagne. It's really, really pretty. I love it. So pretty. All right, next up, this is really exciting as well. This is the Kat Von D Lolita liquid lipstick, which is probably like Kat Von D's most famous liquid lipstick, Lolita, right? I know back in the day, like when I first started my channel, this was the, like when liquid lipsticks first came out, Lolita was the lipstick to get. It was sold out like in every Sephora ever. Okay, so this is the finished look. I actually really, really love how this lip pairs with these eyes. I love it. The only thing I don't like is my blush. Like, I look like a clown right now. But I do love how everything else turned out. Like, like this. Beautiful. 
We have one more product though, one more. Last but not least, we have this product from the brand Pharmacy. I just recently started getting into pharmacy and some of their products are really, really good. This is the Green Clean Makeup Melt Away Cleansing Balm. And it says on the actual packaging, made exclusively for BoxyCharm. I don't know if this size was personally made exclusively for BoxyCharm or just this product in general. Like I don't know if they have this on Sephora or what, I haven't checked. But it's a nourishing facial cleansing balm that melts away makeup and pollution residue. Even the boldest eye makeup and long wear foundation is easily removed, leaving skin hydrated and silky smooth. Okay, we shall see. We shall see. This retails for $22, and um, I'm just gonna scoop some out. Probably not super hygienic, but gonna <laughs> melt them in my fingers and just. Hold on. I went to clean my fingers for a second because I'm still not done. Take it off the mascara. Okay, I'm gonna go rinse my face. I'll be right back. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I didn't wash my face or anything i just rinsed my face like i honestly just wet my entire face and then just patted it dry and look all gone like all of my makeup is gone and i mean i know cleansing balms do that this isn't like a, a brand new product not anything you've never seen before but a lot of the cleansing balms i've tried in the past or a lot of cleansing oils will leave a little bit of a film on your skin if it's nighttime i would recommend washing your face anyway after a cleansing balm but most of the time i feel like I gotta wash my face right after. Like I have this film on my skin where it just doesn't feel super clean and this doesn't have a film on my skin. Yet my face feels really moisturized and hydrated. I don't know. I am so, so happy with this. I think this is my favorite product in the box. Like I'm not kidding. I, I don't know. I didn't expect to love it this much. I'm gonna go put this like in my bathroom right now. I'm gonna be using this from now on to remove my makeup at night. Okay, so it's the end of the video, but I completely forgot to tell you guys the overall value of the box. So I added everything up on my calculator, and the overall value is $130, which is crazy, because BoxyCharm is $21. The, the price always gets me. It always gets me in the end. So yeah, just wanted to tell you that. But yeah, guys, that completes this video. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. I feel like I look like a... A fairy bank robber. My elf ears are on point with this mask on and I just kind of feel like I'm about to rob a fairy bank. Like I'm a fairy that's about to rob another fairy bank. <gasps> oh my gosh, I almost knocked down everything.